Life happens and smartphones are a big part of our lives these days. And when you combine the two, you definitely add that added risk of something happening to those devices. LifeProof provides a way to protect your devices from the elements, from everyday life, and just any kind of circumstance to which your device could become damaged. This is the LifeProof free case for the Pixel XL. They do make one for the regular size Pixel and I'll leave a link down below in the description if you want to pick one up for yourself. One of the biggest reputations that LifeProof has is obviously the waterproof capability that these cases add to your device. When adding a LifeProof case to your device, it's submersible up to 6.6 .6 feet, it's dirt proof, snow proof, and even drop proof up to 6 feet. So as you can see, it provides 360 degrees of protection and you can live on with your life. You don't have to worry about water getting in the way, dirt, or anything like that of those kind of elements. And one of the things that I appreciate about LifeProof is that when you have this case installed on a device is that you're able to really capture moments. You're not worried about something happening to your device. It kind of just adds value to your life because you're not worried about something happening. You're not going to miss out on a moment. You're not going to miss out on some action that you're trying to take part of. So being that this is a waterproof case, I definitely had to do some water testing on my own. And I captured the water test on Snapchat and you can follow me at Joshua Bain. That's where I'm gonna be posting a bunch of snaps and especially from my Snapchat spectacles. You definitely wanna follow me over there for some behind the scenes kind of looks. And not surprising that the water test was just fine. So I was excited to get this installed onto my phone. And it's relatively easy to do so. I've been using this case for about one week now and it's really not been a bad experience at all. The last time I used a LifeProof case was an iPhone 4S and it was not the greatest experience. With these kind of cases, there's three concerns I always look out for. One is the built-in screen protector. Does it take away from the touchscreen experience? Two is the call quality. There were times in the past where I struggled to hear somebody and they had a hard time hearing me. And lastly, are the buttons hard to press? So when I got this case for the Google Pixel, those were the main three areas that I was looking for. I knew that the waterproofing was gonna be just fine. They've proven themselves over and over that it's gonna be a great case for that purpose. The touchscreen experience was just fine. The only thing that I don't like is that it's not a glass feel, but I can forgive that because this is a lifeproof waterproof case and it's kind of to be expected. The buttons are pretty stiff. They're not horrible, they're not unusable, but I definitely want them to be more tactile. And as far as the call quality goes, I could hear people just fine and people could hear me just as well. So as far as using this as a daily driver case, it definitely does the job. It adds a little bit of extra bulk and you might have a little bit of issue putting it inside some of those tight fitting pockets if you wear skinny jeans or anything like that. You're just gonna have to know that this is gonna add some extra bulk. And with this being the Google Pixel XL, it's already a large device. The only other area that I might've been concerned about is the camera. I wanted to know if it picked up recording well and also if you could hear through the speaker. So I did a little bit of a test, so here it is. So I wanted to give you an example of what the audio was like and if the picture quality was good as well. I have the LifeProof case installed. I'm using the front facing camera on the Google Pixel XL. So let me know down in the comments of what you think what the quality is like, both audio and visual. All right, so now I'm just walking along and I wanted to do a little video test for the rear facing camera as well. Let me know what the audio sounds like and also what the visual is like. Does it seem like the video is kind of messed up? So let me know down in the comments about what you think. So yeah, I used the case as a daily driver case for about a week or so, and it's been a good experience. Like I could really see myself using this for a long extended period of time, especially if I was in the elements a lot and needed that kind of protection. You can also get some accessories to match along with whatever kind of lifestyle that you're living. Like if you like to go biking, there's a bike and bar mount. You also have an armband that you can purchase as well. So there's really cool stuff that really adds to the experience of the LifeProof case. If you wanna pick up any of that kind of stuff, there'll be a link down below in the description. Thank you guys so much for watching. I appreciate it. Hit a thumbs up if you enjoyed this video. Also subscribe and also hit that notification bell so you know when a video drops. Let me know what you think about this case down in the comments and also share this with your favorite social networks. And until then, stay techy.